TFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials finished down 300. NASDAQ off 115. S&P's off 33. Now, we'll go right to the volume, man, because the bottom line is that we were pulling back with light volume. Yeah, you get, you know, well, you get light volume. You get 800 billion, 800 million versus 900 million inside the NYSE. If we go into the composite, composite is that uh, it's going to be like 4 billion. You're 3.9. You're going at the 4.5, so same type of setup there. If we go take a look at the SPY, now the SPY had a little volume. Yeah, not as much as it, it, it come, coming into, though. You're, you're coming into 97 million, you did 71. We're at 431.41. 431.70 is the highs of the lows. The lows out there are 427. The NDX looks like it's probably going to go to the lows of that, and well, you can see you, you've, you've had the contraction of volume. So yesterday, what we did out here, folks, is yesterday you did uh, 53 million. We did 45 today, but the 45, you're going into 50. Now, that being said, we're at 357.60. Now, the high of the low of the, of the eighth is 359.65. So when you get two points into it, the probability goes much higher. You're going to get to the bottom. So I expect that's where we're going to go. And we'll see how the market handles that. Gold. Gold contract out here. They pull back. You get 180,000 contracts. That being said, you're going into 254,000 contracts. So it's going to need a lot more contract volume to basically take gold south. Now, silver is going to get really intriguing, man. Uh, the difference in silver, not the difference. The sil silver came down with volume. Um, if you do happen to be a council charting or a candlestick charting technician, you're going to like what you're seeing here because what you have here, this is a last engulfing. And what a last engulfing is, folks, is this, is that you have a downtrend. You, you go sideways for a bit. You open higher. You close lower, and you take uh, this whole thing out. And it looks wicked bearish. The bottom line, if in, it's a, it's a two-day signal, actually. The first day is this. The second day, it has to close above the lows of today, which is 2564. But you have that bearish, I mean, that um, last engulfing in a big way. Have a great weekend, folks. Have a safe weekend. Please tell your friends about TFNN. Ask them to go to YouTube, search TFNN, subscribe. It is free. Come back and join us Monday morning. Tommy kicks us off, 9 a.m. Great show. Have a great weekend, folks, and have a safe weekend.